Hi everyone, I'm Simon and welcome to Cold Water Tanks. A new update from the new tank, the Krabitat this time. Uh, I'm again trying to narrate the video instead of just using text. Uh, this time I hope it'll be in stereo, uh, unlike the last time, uh, sorry about that. Anyways, uh, the scorpion spider crab I got the last time uh, has been in the tank for, for a little while now. And it seems to be doing good. Uh, I'm interested to see if the sponges that's covering the crab will survive in there. Uh, also wondering what will happen when it eventually molts. What will happen to the sponges then? Uh, I've had another one of this species uh, for a while in my other tank. But I've never actually seen it molt. So I don't know if they do it less often than other crabs. I'm hoping I'll be hoping I'll be there to see it if or when it does molt at some point. It's fun to see the way they clean their eyes or whatever it is they're doing. Really hope the sponges or whatever it is will will stay there as it gives the crab a particularly cool look, I think. Uh, here's a small snail. Uh, I believe it's a small common whelk. Uh, which is a predatory snail. Also, I added this cool looking scallop. Uh, usually when I add these to my tanks, they're smaller than this, and uh, then ends up as snacks for various creatures. Uh, but this one is big enough not to get eaten by anything here, I think. Uh, they eat by filtering the water, so, so I'll be doing a lot of water changes in this tank. And hopefully that is that is enough to keep it to keep it alive. Uh, the tiny crab here is a little decorator crab. It's a highest, I think it's called. Uh, it's tiny, quite tiny. So yeah, time will tell how much we'll see of this little guy. Uh, I've also added uh, quite a few shrimp, small shrimp and muses in the tank. I usually catch these as uh, food for my fish, but uh, they're pretty cool creatures actually when you look at them closely. Uh, there's no fish in here to eat them now, so yeah. Uh, what do you think though? Should I add any fish in this tank at all eventually or, or just keep it strictly uh, for crabs and crustaceans? Well, that's all for this video. Uh, if you enjoyed it, please hit the like button. If you have any suggestions or feedback, leave a comment. Uh, I would love to hear from you. Uh, and please subscribe if you want to see more videos from this and uh, any of my other tanks. And also hit the notification bell to make sure you'll get notified whenever I upload a new video. Okay, thanks for watching. See you next time.